Welcome you guys to my updated room tour. guys welcome to my room slash my little oasis I absolutely love my room I updated it about four years ago and I really loved how it looked I already have another video on my channel where I show my room um, but there has been some little updates um, to my room after that video so I'm going to show you guys so when you walk in you can see my whole room here is an overview of my entire room and let's start off with this side over here hi <laughs> okay so right over here I have this dresser and this dresser i got it at living spaces i remember not having the best experience with them but it's okay because i still love it and it's held up very well um recently actually my drawers they kept opening by themselves and it was very frustrating because i was like what's going on like is the, are the brackets like not working so i had my dad check it out and all he did, guys, all he did was just go ahead and um, tilt it because it wasn't leveled. So it was leveled forward. So the drawers just kept opening because they were obviously heavy. Anyways, so let's start over here. Um, over here, I have my little area that has my perfumes, um, some of my favorite perfumes, which I actually don't really use this one. The the Mademoiselle. And then right down here, I have um, a little tray thingy that has like some of the necklaces that I always wear. And then what's in here? I forgot. Oh, some other necklaces. And then I think um, other necklaces and probably some rings. So right over here, I have this candle that I recently got at Target. I really love this candle. Um, I really like the way it looks and then I also really love the way that it smells. They should still probably have them available there. And then over here I have a picture frame. Oops, there you go. Picture frame of my nephews and I recently got this picture frame at, an, um, at Target as well. And I really love it. I think it like fits perfectly with my room decor. And um, yeah, those are my nephews. They're so cute. I love them so much. If you know me, you know that uh, my nephews mean everything to me. I have five nephews and they're all boys and I don't have any kids of my own. So they really mean a lot to me. Um, right over here, I have my Marshall speaker and I love my Marshall speaker. It's so cute. I love that it's portable and I love the color. It's like a cream kind of color. I feel like it looks a little bit more white on camera, but it's so pretty and I use it all the time to listen to my music. And then right up here, I have this cute little thing that I, um, I didn't buy it actually. My mom bought it and I stole it from her because I loved it. I think she might've got it probably like Marshalls or TJ Maxx or something like that. And she like came home one day and she's like, oh, look what I got, like something like that. And then I was just like, oh my God, I love it. And I was like, give it to me. <laughs> she gave it to me. Um, I actually think this is for bathroom. I think it's kind of like a cot like cottons, cotton holder or something like that. But I use it as store like jewelry in it. So I just like have some earrings that, um, I have earrings that I usually wear. So like a lot of gold earrings. And there, right over here, I have this cute little journal that I bought also at Target. 
um, I just thought it was so freaking cute and I haven't even used it but I just think it's like really adorable so I just kind of use it as decor because I really like the embroidered um, details in, in there so I just use it as decor underneath this and then right over here I have this planter thing I don't even know like a little stand for a planter and I got this at TJ Maxx yeah actually I think it was one of the last times I went to TJ Maxx I miss going um haven't gone obviously because of the quarantine so it sucks but I got this at TJ Maxx and it was only like $12 and I thought it was the cutest cutest thing and I feel like it just like looks so nice right here with that planter at first I didn't really like how it looked I felt like it was a little bit too tight um too tall but then um after I got a little bit used to it and I feel like it just like adds um some height to that little corner of my dresser so I think it looks really pretty and I have here my beautiful plant that is so easy to maintain um, I believe it's called something like a snake something. I'm not sure, but it's so cute. And then right over here, I have my big mirror. It's um, like a little round mirror. I used to have a square one, but I am in love with this one. I forgot where I got it. I think I got it at like, mm, don't know if I got it at Target or something like that or TJ Maxx because I always get everything there, but I just like have some pictures of me and my boyfriend right here. This is um, when we went to the Grand Canyon for the first time. And then the top one is when we went to Knott's Berry, or not Scary Farm, it was really fun. Um, yeah, and then up here, I have like these like little lanterns that have been up there for the longest time. Um, my dad put them up there for me and I just think they look really cute. And my bedding, I really, really love my bedding. Um, I just have this kind of like a quilted bedding thing from, you can find these every, like, I think at TJ Maxx is where I usually get them. Um, TJ Maxx or, um, let me see, let me try to think. Oh, TJ Maxx or Home Goods. Yeah, because they're like the same. And right over here, I have my bed, my pillows. I believe the four big pillows. So all four big pillows I got at either TJ Maxx or Home Goods. No, I think I got them at Home Goods. And the little round pillow, I got it at um, Forever 21 a long time ago. It was like so random, but I just like went in there and they had these cute pillows and I was like, oh my gosh, that's so cute. So I got it. I used to have like a little button in the middle, but it came off because it's I'm telling you, I've had it for a while. And then up here is this cute like macrame um, decor piece that my dad made for me. Um, I told him I wanted like a little macrame thing and I bought cord and I told him, can you, can you try to make something for me? And he's like, yeah, I got this, I could do it. So he made this for me and I really love it. He made it for me a long time ago, probably like four years ago now that I think of it. So. It's been there for quite some time and I really love it. I think it just looks really nice above my bed. Looks really nice. So then over here in this little corner, I have a little dresser and, um, not a dresser, sorry, a side table. And I absolutely love this side table. I believe I got it at TJ Maxx or Home Goods, one of those two. I always find my wood pieces there. They have like really great wood pieces at TJ Maxx and Home Goods. Um, so I just have over here. I have a a candle that my friend recently got me for my birthday. She just gave it to me like the other day. I got it in the mail, and I really, really love it. I not only love the way that it looks because I think it looks really pretty with the like. Um, What's that name? What's the name of that? I think it's like a, an amber color. Yeah, an amber color. And then it smells really good. So I definitely recommend this candle. And I just have a cute picture frame of my other two nephews. Um, 
They're so cute. I love them so much. And in the bag, I have this little art piece that an ex-boyfriend gave to me. <laughs> and then over here, I have this beautiful plant that my mom gave to me. Or actually, I stole it from her again. <laughs> but I feel like it hasn't grown and I really want to know what kind of plant it is so I could get more of it because I really love it, but I wish it was like fuller. But it's really, really pretty. And then down here, I have this basket filled with books and yeah, just like random books that I have. It's like a little cute basket. And then up here is my latest purchase and this is what completed my entire room. I absolutely love this lantern or pendant light, whatever you wanna call it. Um, I think it just like completes my room and I'm so, so happy. Um, cause I used to have like this like crystal chandelier thing and I just didn't think it went with my room, but I think this like definitely completes my whole room and I'm so happy. So yeah, so that's what I have up there. I got it from World Market. They still have it online. And then over here I just have my curtains. They're just sheer curtains. Um, cause I like to have very, I liked my room to be very bright, so. I like these sheer curtains and I've had them for a long time, about four years, and I washed them and they still look really, really good. So that's really cool. Like I could, you know, just pop them in the washer and they'll be good. And then right over here is this little corner that I have that I absolutely love. So right over here is a chest and that chest it's like a treasure chest sort of i got it at home goods and it's where i store all of my camera stuff so i have all of my camera stuff in there and then up here i have this frame of frida kahlo whom i really like her art she's so cool i've actually been to her house um in um where was it in Mexico City, in Coyoacan, that's what it's called. And yeah, I just love her. I got this little piece actually like, uh, I think in um, Puerto Nuevo, close to T TJ. Um, and it's just like a little like, kind of like cheap, not cheap necessarily, but just like, it's not like a real piece of art. That's what I'm trying to say, I guess. Um, but I don't care. I still feel like it looks like really nice over here. And over here I added these hats that I kind of just wanted something, something there, you know, cause I felt like it was kind of lonely. So I just put up these hats as kind of like a decor. I love these hats, definitely recommend. Um, they're almost, I want to say they're like the same quality as lack of colors, but they're like half of the price of those hats. So I definitely recommend, got them from Lucy Avenue. And then over here, I'm gonna just show you guys my, my little treasure chest. There you go, that's my treasure chest. I have all of my stuff. All of my camera stuff, it looks a little bit messy in there, but it's not. I have my instant camera stuff, my regular camera stuff, a bunch of little junk pieces, not junk, but like, like knickknacks that I don't know where to store. So I love this. It comes in so like, handy for me since I don't really want to just like throw my stuff everywhere. I like that I have like somewhere to actually store it. And right over here I have my desk. And this desk, I also bought it at either TJ Maxx or Home Goods. And I just have my computer. I have this little oil diffuser that I got at Target recently, so they probably still have it there. I have my camera, my Polaroid camera pretty much. And then over here I have my wall piece which 
my dad made for me and I helped him by staining them. Uh, there are these shelves that I had seen somewhere. I'm not sure where I had seen them and I was like, I really want those. And I, at the same time, I was like, okay, those are really easy to make. So I told my dad and of course he made them for me. He made a few sets actually. I think he made about like five or six or seven, like six or seven sets of these. And so yeah, so I really, really love it. I think it's so, so cute. I just like have some like random little things like my Polaroid. Um, those, all three of those things I got at, um, I got in Mexico. Over here I have um, another little Frida Kahlo that I also got in Mexico. It's kind of like a ceramic tile. And then up here I have a vintage camera that I wish worked and I really want to get one soon when that works so I could use it. And then up there I have the best birthday present I've ever got in my entire life. My sister got it for me and I cried when I got it because it's literally, it's literally me and my dog, Blue, because he wears bow ties too, so it's the cutest thing. I think that's like the cutest thing I own. <laughs> and then down here I have my chat books and I absolutely love chat books, definitely recommend them. It pretty much prints your Instagram feed in a little book. And it's so cute, I love these, and I have so many of them already. And then right here, I have this little, kind of like a little wicker basket that I got in Mexico when I went one time to, I think it was Yucatan. And um, these women, they make these, and they're so cute. And I remember I got one for my mom and my sister, and I just like keep my matches in there. For when I light my candles and then my desk over here I just have my random little things in there um, over here I think is where I keep my yeah where I keep my chargers for my cameras and stuff some paperwork and then this little chair I believe I probably got it at one of those two stores GG Max or home goods of course and then right over here, I have this mirror. Hello. And it's just a full length mirror. And this is where I look at my outfits when I get ready. <laughs> and then yeah, and then I'll just show you guys my closet really quick. I recently fixed it. So it looks kind of nice, I guess. Um, I fixed my hats, my bags, and I definitely fixed my shoes because they were really, really messy. So I have a lot of shit that I don't even wear, but it's okay. And then on this side, I have more bags at the top and one right there that I recently got some dresses. So this is all my dress dresses here, yeah. And some shoes, yeah. And then right over here by my mirror, or not by my mirror, by my closet, I have this cute little mirror that I got in Lucky Bucket. Oh, I need to clean it. It's kind of dirty, but it's super cute. The view from it is really cute too. But yeah, you guys, I hope you guys enjoyed my room tour. If you guys have any questions of where I got some things, let me know. Again, I hope you guys really enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you guys did. And yeah, bye guys.